to my channel. I am here with my basic go-to shower routine video for y'all. What I mean by my basic go-to. So if I am like about to go to bed and I just want to get clean and I don't feel like my normal bedtime scents and I really don't want to take that long in the shower, I just want to smell clean and feel good, then this is the combination that I use. I also go for this one if I'm about to participate in extreme sweaty activities, i.e. like working out or I'm about to be outside all day in the Texas sun. I know I'm going to sweat. Now it might sound weird that I shower before I work out. I don't always, but like 95% of the time I do because ever since I was pregnant with my daughter, I get very, very hot really easily, especially at nighttime. And I sweat sometimes in the middle of the night and usually I work out in the morning. So I don't, and I really mean I do not like to build sweat on top of sweat. It just grosses me out. So I take a quick shower, that way I smell clean before I go work out. And then when I go and sweat and I work out, it's not like double the stink, you know what I'm saying? And if I'm about to be outside all day and I know I'm gonna sweat a lot, like hiking or something like that, I do, again, wanna get clean because I don't like building sweat on top of sweat, but also I don't like using my kind of all out fancy scents for things like that when I know I'm just gonna sweat it off because one, I don't wanna smell like sweaty pineapple, sweaty papaya, sweaty coconut, it just doesn't sound good to me. I just want a clean, fresh start. So that is what I mean when I say my basic go-to. I use this weekly, I love it. Also, when I'm at home and I don't have like a lot of time to shower, this is what I go for when I only have like five to 10 minutes before my kids need me. This is all around. Now this is different than my sensitive skin shower routine. So I will show that in a different video. So I hope you all enjoyed this video and without further ado, let's get into it. Per usual, my loves, we are going to start off with a bar soap and a washcloth. If you're new to my channel, I always like to start off my hygiene routines with a bar soap and washcloth just because I like a little base clean before I get into everything else. Bar soaps are great for that and they kind of help accentuate whatever scent you're going to follow up with. And I like washcloths because they get in between like the little creases and crevices much better, especially like behind the ears. And I like to use washcloths for both my downstairs areas as well. Now time for the body wash. And of course we're going in with the Dove Deep Moisture. You guys know that I'm obsessed with this one. It's something that I've been using for years and years and years. And I think it's perfect if you have sensitive skin but you kind of want a scent, then this is like really good for that. It's not like an in your face fruity or like perfumey type of scent. It's just that nice clean, type of smell and that's exactly what we're going for for this basic go-to routine and I feel like the Dove white bar has that kind of clean scent to it as well so together it's just like mm, it's so perfect I don't know what it is but I love like a kind of clean linen type of smell I guess you could say it's just something that I kind of always gravitate towards and you know there's never like a wrong time to have that type of scent so this is perfect for that Okay, so since this is also like I don't have a lot of time, but I need a shower really quick kind of routine, I don't typically shave during this time, but I do want to exfoliate the like rougher areas that people might touch or that are going to be exposed, so like my hands, shoulders, elbows, knees, and feet. I just kind of want to give like a quick rub down so that they're nice and soft. I do love the Dr. Teal scrub. I think it's perfect for this because the pink salt one doesn't really have a scent to it. It's not like overpowering, so it won't take away from the clean smell we're trying to accomplish it's definitely thicker than like the tree hut scrubs it's not as oily or watery so it has a different consistency but also I don't really wear makeup or anything like that so a lot of time I just take a clean warm washcloth and kind of rub over my face and it does perfectly fine and then I'm going to moisturize with the Cetaphil moisturizing lotion I've been using this as a face lotion 
probably since high school. I think it's perfect for sensitive skin and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. And then once my face is all moisturized, I'm going to put my deodorant on. I dabble back and forth between the Dove Dry Spray Original Clean and the Dry Spray Nourished Beauty. They both have that kind of like drier sheet scent. They're both very clean smelling, so they both work perfectly for this routine. I love them both equally. Next, I think this is so important. Take a probiotic, you guys. This is my favorite brand. You can get it from Target or from Amazon. I think a probiotic is essential to hygiene health. And then I'm going to brush my teeth with the activated charcoal from Hello. And I don't use this every morning or every day. It's kind of messy with the blackness. Like when you spit, it can like get everywhere and kind of stain stuff so you have to be really careful but i try to use it like three to four times a week and then next for mouthwash you guys when i first used this i told you i absolutely hated it it was the worst but it's kind of oddly growing on me so i don't know how i feel about it i'm not saying i love it and that it's the best mouthwash ever but i don't quite hate it anymore i kind of like it i won't lie but for moisturizing our entire body, we are going to go in with the St. Ives Renewing Lotion. And oh, you guys, if there was a lotion perfectly picked out for a clean, basic shower routine, this is it. It's just... Mm, it's divine and yet it's just so simple it's just amazing with this routine but for body sprays i'm going in with a thousand wishes you can kind of go in with whatever because it's such a base foundation but this scent has that crisp champagne which i think just pairs perfectly with other clean scents so i love this one okay my queens we are done we are clean we are smelling really good I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you all have a great rest of your week. I love you all so much. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.